Oh, those ubiquitous paparazzi. They will pick up famous people to capture them in the most unpredictable situations. And if the event is already open to the press, the camera flashes will not subside until the most racy shots are caught. Famous ladies, politicians, first ladies, princesses, and queens are people too. Dress with a needle, complementing the outfit with the best jewelry, they sometimes look funny and amusing. Thus, with all the pathos and greatness of her position, Queen Elizabeth II is never afraid to appear funny. Her brooches are always perfectly matched, but the wife of Mikhail Gorbachev sought to look elegant and strict. And in public she did not allow to have too much fun, as she never had fancy jewelry. Well, without unnecessary reasoning, I propose to remember today the most amusing photos from the life of the stars of world politics. And don't forget about jewelry, how can you do without it? Even the most expensive necklace looks lifeless if its owner looks like an ice block in public. And only a woman with a storm of emotions is able to give the jewelry a bright life. While Elizabeth Ayo is primping and painting her lips with her favorite lipstick, reporters are not slumbering. Oh my god, royalty are people too, will exclaim fans of the royal family. The ruler's outfit is impeccably chosen, and her pearl jewelry set is truly aristocratic. Classic earrings of white pearls and a brooch with a pearl and a sparkling scatter of diamonds seem perfect to us, but Elizabeth herself often gets tired of strict rules, and looks quite earthy woman, who, by the way, loves red lipstick. But etiquette, alas, requires a pink tone. In the next photo, Her Majesty is already at a more elegant age. Some quick schoolboy jumped out in front of the Queen to take an unforgettable selfie with Elizabeth Edu. The white gloves, pearl jewelry set is my particular favorite here. Look at how fabulous the brooch is. With snow-white pearls, it depicts an imperial crown. The sparkle of the clear diamonds is dazzling and the simplicity of an English boy looks very funny against the elegant clothes of the crown grandmother. King Charles III and his wife are a merry couple. In any situation, they sincerely laugh, and sometimes and laugh. It seems that Camilla Parker Bowles decided to hold in her hands some historical knife from among the museum rarities, or on the contrary, a unique product of modern British craftsmen. The cold weapon frightened Charles, judging by the look on his face. Cautiously, he points to the steel in his wife's hands. We have a good view of his gold signet ring, a classic, aristocratic piece of jewelry. Such a ring is a reminder of the former greatness of the British Empire, of those forgotten times when a multitude of colonies fed Queen Britain with money, land, people, gems, and other bottomless resources. The Princess of Wales is called by many as the future queen of the country. The subjects adore Kate Middleton because she always follows the image of a good girl simple and sophisticated, smiling and strict at the same time. And at the royal races, she laughed heartily when Sophie of Wessex almost fell off when leaving the carriage, right on top of Kate. The Countess's chick pendant on a sparkling chain, which green in color immediately catches the eye. The jewelry harmonizes with the shade of the elegant dress, and even the pretentious hat did not overshadow the unique necklace. A lot of funny shots will be found in the piggy bank of Russian history. The first fashionista of the USSR, the wife of Mikhail Gorbachev, never once fell in the mud, and she was certainly not going to look ridiculous. Large clips with metallic shine exactly follow the trends of American fashion. When her hands intertwined with Barbara Bush's palms in a welcoming gesture, the First Lady of the Soviet Union only smiled discreetly. Barbara Bush, on the other hand, exuded a sea of emotion. Her set with snow-white pearls looks chic. The gold-rimmed pearls and the tiered choker seem to tell us the story of a contented, satisfied life in the United States. At least, the elite of the state. Of course, Gorbachev's wife never allowed herself excessive luxury. After all, she was already criticized, discussed without measure, and disliked. German Chancellor Angela Merkel has for many years maintained a reputation as a lady with a strong core. Indeed, there is a lot of masculinity in her, and in politics you can't do without it. When Mrs. Merkel has fun in public, she is German restrained, and even the laughter of a lady standing next to her does not allow her to lose her European face. Merkel looks fresh, and the sky turquoise color scheme of her jacket is emphasized by the delicate shade of a modest necklace from her numerous collections. No, our fashionistas did not sign up for such costume jewelry, 
Russian women want jewelry that is more solid and larger, no less than Barbara Bush's. Perhaps Valentina Mapienko would not refuse the jewelry boxes once owned by Duchess Caetana de Alva. The elderly aristocrat was not afraid of looking ridiculous and enjoyed freedom until the last day of her life. Look at the diamonds, the gold, the gems. If you grow old, then only like this, with a cheerful smile on your face and in the sensual rhythms of the Spanish dance.